When Jessica first told me she was seeing Ralph, I was cautious and wanted to make sure Ralph would be the right guy to take care of Jessica. She would share stories about their dates, the present that he would spoil her, the fancy restaurants. I've never seen Jessica so in love and happy. But the moment I knew when Ralph was the one, when he joined Jessica and I on movie night, we picked a romantic comedy featuring Cameron Diaz. The theater was mainly women. And about maybe 30 minutes into the movie, I thought, wow, Jessica hit the jackpot. A man watching a chick flick and not a word of complaint. When I looked at Ralph during the movie, he was fast asleep. <laughs> I can't even begin to express how proud I am of you, especially in the last few years, as I watched you grow into a more adventurous, independent, dare I say, more stylish person during your time in New York. Although I'm the older one, it was during this time that tables started to turn and it was me who started to look up to you and admire how far you've come and the person you are today. Since Ralph wanted me to so badly say out loud for the first time how much I love you, here it is. I do love you and I appreciate you just the mess. I have no doubt in my mind that you and Ralph were meant to be and feel so blessed to witness you both finally tying the knot today. So in closing, I would just like to quote my favorite uh, Chinese proverb. Qian Li, just sing. Shu, Su Chia, Su Chia. Did I got it right? <laughs> the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Today, Jessica and Ralph, is your first step towards your first mile on your matrimonial journey. You still have 999 miles to go, so to speak. <laughs> so, along the way, you will come across potholes and bumps, but just uh, stay calm, stay happy, fight, but don't fight too much, and carry on loving. Yeah. Mm -hmm.